So I have decided that I'm preparing to go back to the East Coast. Um, so I'm, that's what I'm doing. I'm staying home today to get some work done because actually I don't feel well today. But since I don't feel well, I just don't want to sit home and do nothing. So I'm just going to continue to do work, you know, and um, secure everything with me going back to the um, East Coast. I'm definitely, definitely grateful for my experience here in California. But, you know, at this time, um, I like the thought of being in California, but just not living here. I can't live here permanently because it is such a hassle trying to run a business across country. Um, honestly, I definitely played myself because I thought I could do it. But it's so, it's exhausting um, and mentally, emotionally. And then, like, I'm dropping new active wear um, joggers for men. And the models that I'm gonna use on the East Coast, um, the photographer that I love to use, she's in the East Coast. And I don't wanna change it. Like once I work with people and we have a, um, a great relationship, a great working relationship, I don't like to change it. I like to keep it consistent. The key to this is being organized. When you're organized, it's easy to move. Believe me, I know. So I'm at U-Haul right now, shipping my U-Box. This is what the U-Box looks like. It's pretty big. That could get like furniture in it, I guess. So after I'm done shipping it, I just put on my lock. And the lock that I use is like a standard like storage lock. Um, and then I'll just load it up and then it'll be good to go. Um, they say it takes like seven to 15 days to get to a cross country, but you just have to estimate it to take longer. So I'm not putting anything in here that I'm going to need immediately. Just stuff that, you know, I can wait for. This is the lock that I was talking about right there. And I almost forgot my, um, I almost packed away my resistance bands and my mat, my exercise mat. But I definitely need that. Another thing, my advice to anyone would be to get, not to demean anyone's intelligence, but to get renter's insurance. Not renter's insurance, but shipping insurance, whatever it's called. But get insurance when you do this kind of stuff because you just never know and you don't want to take a chance. But look at the U box. The amount of money that I'm paying for this, I thought it would be a lot prettier, but I guess not. So that's how you lock the lock. And of course you keep the keys with you. So voila, there you have it. My U-Box is ready to for shipping. And this really is like a box. If anyone was in the shipping business, I would suggest to do this. I'm here at the airport in Charlotte, North Carolina. I actually slept very well, I'm surprised. So now I'm taking another flight to New York. Do not carry items belonging to others. Note that all bags are subject to search. Report any suspicious.